Hi guys, um, I'm back with uh, another video and this is basically a declutter video. I'm just wanting to get rid of some stuff that I've had for a long time and never used or I've never opened them. Um, and I'm basically just going to be passing them on to someone who I think might actually use them. Um, because they're just sitting in my makeup collection and I'm not using them and I don't want them to go to waste because I did spend the money on them and I want to make sure that they get good use out out of what they're supposed to be doing so the first one that I pull up and have in my hand here is this liquid eyeliner it is a from Maybelline Master Duo by iStudio um, and it's in the color Violet Luster. Um, it is opened because I tried it once and I didn't like the little tip that it has on it because it's not a brush um, because I'm still trying to learn how to use eyeliners. Um, if you can see this is the tip that it has and it was just no good. It was just honestly not a good tip. Um, I'm gonna swatch the color so you can see it. And the color is very light purple. It's that purple right there. No good. So I'm just going to get rid of it and give it to someone else that might use it. And the next thing that I have that I'm picking up right now is I have five of these. Um, again, Target closing. I always talk about Target closing down in Canada because it did happen. It is a true thing. And I have five of these Sonic Ashik eyeshadow pen, um, eyebrow pencil, or eyeshadow eyebrow definer pencils. Um, as you can see, I barely have any eyebrows, There's, and it doesn't bother me, like it really, the fact that I don't have any eyebrows does not bother me one bit, so I don't really use them and I don't see the need for them. I only bought them because they were there and I guess everyone was talking about them at the time I bought them so I figured I may need one and well I don't so I'm trying to open one to swatch it so that you guys can see what it looks like well it really doesn't want to be open so I'm not even gonna bother I'll probably do a swatch at the end there's actually six I'm gonna open it at the end to swatch it and you guys can see what it looks like when it's done now the next thing is this I'm not sure if I'm gonna give this away or keep it um, because I still do like the colors it's the eyeshadow collection I got this in an ipsy ipsy bag a long time ago the one and only ipsy bag that I've ever received from their California collection um, by BH Cosmetics and it came with three colors um, the first one is Hollywood the second one is San Francisco and the third one is Malibu and I believe that these are very very beautiful colors so I'm still considering whether or not I should keep these um, I'm not sure yet not sure yet so I'm gonna put these to the side um, eyeshadows that I definitely know that I'm getting rid of um, are these these eyeshadows here the cheap and sexy 15 color plus 2 blusher from Broadway eyes um did not like it tried it did not like it and I have another palette there that I did use I did not use this palette but as you can tell these colors are not even pigmented these colors here they're not even 
pigmented. I don't like these colors at all. Um, actually, no. I like these colors, but I don't like the fact that they're not pigmented. And when they put them on, they don't stay on very long. I even put it on in the other palette that I'm going to show you guys with a primer. The only reason it stayed on was because I put the primer on. And once I took it off, it came off came off very easily enough but it started to crease and it didn't it just it was just a hot mess basically this is the palette that I used and this is their sleek and smoky eye palette from Broadway eyes and it's the same thing 15 co eye colors and two blushes I've only used this one twice and I didn't like it and I, I, I know I'm a person if I don't like one palette in one thing I know I'm not gonna like it in the other so I'm not going to going to stress myself out with it I am just going to get rid of it and hopefully the person that I'm giving it to which is my niece will end up using it and liking it much better than I did the next eye palette that I am giving away also are decluttering is this one and this is from Cosmo Colors. I actually got this in a haul way back when I went to Dollarama. Um, the colors are very beautiful but I don't, it's too much purple. Too much purple. There's a swatch of one of the purple and it's this purple right here that I swatch and that's what it looks like right there um, if you guys can actually see it no you can't it's that purple right there I don't like it and I'm just not going to even bother with it um, I'm just getting rid of it just because it's sitting there and I'm not using it and it just makes absolutely no sense so away it goes the next one that I am getting rid of is actually a lip palette and this one is very hard to open um, okay so here's the lip stains that I was talking about earlier um, I bought it off of um, online and in the picture it looked very nice and I did use it as you can tell there are a couple colors that got a couple uses out of them but I pretty much moved on from this and it's just sitting there um I just haven't used it because as I said I've moved on to other better things that I find more usable um and the next one that I'm getting rid of is this one. It is so huge. It has 77 eyeshadows and 77 lip colors. Um, I've never used it. And I'm not... I've just never ever used it. And there's no point in it sitting in my collection when I've never used it. Um, this is an e.l.f. eyeshadow palette. And it's the very first eyeshadow palette that I ever, ever bought when I started doing it. And that was three years ago. And it's got some good use out of it, but again, I've moved on. Um, I've moved on to using much better eyeshadows. These are so beautiful, but as I said, I've moved on to using better eyeshadows and better, better quality eyeshadows. Um, I might reconsider keeping this to go back to it in order to use some of it when I do need it. Um, I'm not sure. The only reason I consider I would consider going back to this is because it is my first eye palette and 
it has a sentimental place in my heart, basically, because it is the first eye palette that I ever bought and the first one that I ever used to do new colors. So that might need some more consideration on my part. We'll think about that one. The next one is this blush kit. Um, I don't want to open it too much because it's going to fall out. Yeah, it's falling out. So this is a blush kit that it's in a MAC container. Um, but it's these are not MAC blushes and basically I've never used them and they are breaking apart. I'll show you what just happened on my bed when I opened it. Hold on a second. So this is what happened on my bed when I opened the MAC palette um, that I've never used. It's As I said, it's not a palette from MAC, the eyeshadow, but the, the, the thing that I keep it in is from MAC. Um, because that's about the only thing I can af could afford from MAC at the time, but I am now working and I can afford more things. Um, so this is another reason as to why I am getting rid of these blushes and they're actually Mil Milani blushes and they were cheap and they're cheap for a reason and this is pretty much the reason as to why they are cheap because they break easily and they don't stay put together which means when you put them on your cheek it means that they are going to crease and cake and not look very good on your cheeks so it's bye bye Milani blushes no more anyhow that's it guys that's um my mini decluttering videos i want to say thank you guys very much for watching and thank you to all my new subscribers um please don't forget to hit the subscribe button and hit the like button for more videos like this okay again i want to thank you for watching and i will see you in my next video bye